Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in. This is uh, Vito Moretti and you're watching Friends With Your Planet. Today we're going to continue talking about ways to improve your soil with the cover crop called Common Buckwheat. <laughs> Stick around. <laughs> So today we're going to focus on using the cover crop called buckwheat. Now buckwheat is one of those cover crops that takes about 30 to 40 days to grow. Because buckwheat grows so quickly, you can get anywhere between two and up to five growing cycles in one garden season. Thankfully for me, growing buckwheat is actually pretty easy. So as you can see, this bed itself is uh, full of some pretty dry soil. You'll notice these big larger rock kind of things. These are actually pieces of clay. What we want to do is we want to prepare this one so that we can actually plant vegetables in this next year. So this is what we're going to start with. The first thing you want to do is start by removing all of the larger pieces of soil that could keep the buckwheat from growing to its potential. Next you'll want to plant the seeds about a half inch down to an inch down. I just kind of make a couple lines here. Um, about one seed every four inches or so should be fine. And uh, once you get those into the ground, just kind of cover it up, um, flatten it out a little bit. Uh, make sure that you know some of that soil is over the top because if they're planted too close to the top, birds will actually come down and eat the seeds. So one of the things we're going to notice as it grows is we've got our little heart-shaped clover-like leaves. From the heart-shaped leaves, then we're going to start to get some white flowers. And the white flowers will then soon start turning brown. Now the white flowers will then start to turn to seed. You'll see these darker brown husks. And at this point, you can actually chop the plant down. So now, in this bed, I've actually cut the buckwheat down. Uh, I left it maybe two or three inches. Um, you can just leave the cuttings to act as a mulch. Uh, these are here protecting my little mint plant. Now with this particular bed, I'm actually going to dig and flip the buckwheat and get one more planting in before it starts to get cold. So here we've got a shot of buckwheat that's probably about three weeks old. But as we pull it back, you can see how there's not a whole lot of weeds in there. There are still some trouble spots with the soil, but it actually did a pretty good job of covering, covering things up. So now that we have our area planted, I'm just going to mark it here with our little sign. So we've got buckwheat, and in about 30 to 40 days, the stuff should be ready to clip and turn into the soil. 